just because we are too sad. So let us uh, make ourselves happy. Maybe that's it. No tayo ng uh, no tayo ng mga pelikula sa Viva Max, makakaiwas tayo sa catfishing. Kasi busy you know? tayo. Oh, kasi busy tayo. <laughs> Now we are far from danger, we are far from illegal uh, illegal actions, we are far from hurting ourselves if we are busy and if we are happy. Okay, thank you so much. Next, we have a question from Cecil Hinovi of Visayan Daily Star. For direct, what advice can you give to vulnerable netizens, young and old alike, who may find themselves in situations like those in the movie? Uh, if you're going to ask me with the note that if they find their situation in the movie, that's very hard because the situation in the movie is really... Uh, over the top. It's it's really no. As of as as we speak, uh, as we speak now, as we do this press con, um, I'm just nearing the completion of the film. It's like the film is 90% done, so I haven't seen the film yet. No, the film is already complete. It's just that the 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 CG. It's just the you know the computer interface. You know lang yun. Yun na lang yung tinatapos. Mahirap mag-advise eh. Once you're in that, uh, in that uh, predicament, in that situation, it's very hard to give advice. It's a case-to-case basis. But for me, habang wala ka pa sa posisyon at kondisyon uh, na yon sa lugar na yon, it's better to be prevented than to make a remedy about it. So just like what I've said earlier, keep yourself busy and you always, you always have to value yourself. No, the, the the only reason why you are very gullible and vulnerable when it comes to things like catfishing is maybe because you don't appreciate uh, appreciate yourself that much. You are looking for you know appreciation, recognition. You're looking for attention. Maybe if you get that from somewhere else or someone more worthy or more worthy or someone who is actually a real person, you don't get to seek uh, seek it from ano eh, from other stuff. So try to find meaning. You know? If you can't find it from others, maybe you can give it to yourself so that it will be enough. You know, Thank you so much, be, Direkda. Yes. Thank you. For Lassie Kid and Ariala, based on your characters, what are some do's and don'ts when confronted with such situations? Parang pareho nung sinabi kayo ni Direkda. Lassie Kid. Sige, Ariala. Uh, with like portraying <coughs> do's and don'ts para uh, um, yeah, yeah, like, go, confronted with such situations para maiwasan po ito I, I, I guess so I guess so uh, yeah, um, like, dun, based on tarot, your character based on my character para maiwasan yung mga ganun S- siguro unang una maging responsible ka you would know naman ano yung limitation kapag when it comes to that part um, like kung alam mo na na sobra na at may na na naapektuhan ng iba so i guess that's the po- that's the point na we should stop on from my character as Krista dahil alam ko gusto ko lang naman tulungan yung kaibigan ko pero sumobra din kami in a way so siguro ayun yung realization and uh, siguro dapat iwasan natin and uh, yun nga dahil uh, masyado rin kaming na, na napasaya nung <laughs> nag party kami or pumunta kami sa bar something like that so ayun din yung naging isang factor na instead na diretso yung mga pag iisip namin mas na nagkaroon pa ng epekto in other way around yung uh, ginawa namin mga pag-inom or pag-take ng drugs na yun. Yes, Lassie? Yes, tama yung sinabi ni Ariela. Um, um, sa karakter ko kasi is nang gamit ako ng tao eh. Ginamit ko yung kaibigan ko para makuha ko yung gusto ko at uh, makapamera na rin. Like, sinumaan pa kasi naman masasamang ano, eh, elemento eh, like yung pag-drugs, di ba? So, nangyari at hindi dapat mangyari na, na na hindi maganda talaga. So, yun mga dapat na hindi natin gawin. Um, okay lang makipagkilala, makipagkaibigan, pero wag na wag sasamahan ng droga. Kasi hindi natin alam kung ano mangyayari talaga sa mga susunod. 
ng mga itsena. Kit, sarap Thompson? Gusto ko yung iba na yung middle name ko. <laughs> Ay, hindi ba yun? Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Pero S din, S din naman. So, pwede, pwede. Sharep, Sharep Thompson, ganun na. Um, based on my character, siguro yung advice ko is don't make decisions na masyado ko masaya and don't make decisions na galit ka. Um, yeah, yun nga yung katulad niya sabi nila, si okay lang magkipagkilala sa tao. But yeah, you know, katulad sa character ko nung nakilala niya si Krista, yung tinitin niya lang, oh, ang ganda-ganda na ito, pero hindi naman kilala, sumama pa rin siya. So, alam mo yun, uh, just try to be aware more aware of the situation and more aware of what the person's intention is towards you bago ka mag-decide. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kit. For, uh, from Ricky Calderon of The Free Man, for Ariella, ano ang reaction mo when you learn na gagawa ka ng movie with direct Daryl Yap? How is it working with Kit Sarap Thompson? I saw um, di pala sarap. <laughs> sure. <man. laughs> yes, um actually excited nga po ako like what I've said um na si Direct Daryl yung first movie project with with Viva because actually we have a common friend so na share sa akin ng friend ko niyon kung paano ba si Direct and actually then um I'm familiar with the movies na ginagawa ni Direct so I took the chance agad kasi hindi ko alam kung kailan ko ulit siya pwede makatrabaho dahil alam ko busy siya, isa siya sa napaka-busying director. <laughs> Ngayon, mm. at ang dami niya pong artista talaga na nakakasalamuha. So alam mo yun, um, syempre as a director, kapag nagustuhan niya yung isa artista, pwede niya yung kunin ng kunin. So now na naibigay sa akin yung proyekto at si, si Direct Daryl yung uh, director ko. So... I said yes agad doon kasi hindi ko nga po alam kailan ulit yun pwede mangyari. And yes, si Direct sa Shabwis nakatrabaho, parang sikit. Parang sabi ko nga po, parang kami talaga isang magtutropa sa loob ng set. Kaya um, kahit mahirap yung mga nag eksena namin or most of those scenes, first time namin, nagawa namin in a way na na wala yung inhibition namin sa isa't isa because of the way we treat each other off cam na sobrang light na po and para magbabarkada. Mm-hmm. And yeah, I would also, si Kit, si Kit very gentleman niya na katrabaho because I remember yung mahirap na eksena namin like after that, tinanong niya pa talaga kung kamusta, yung something like that dahil uh, siguro nakita niya din how physically I am uh, struggling nung time na yon and emotionally na rin as well so asa ka trabaho din siya din yung um nasasabihan mo especially ko pag uh, lalong lalo na yung eksena namin sa coach <laughs> so mas naging uh, madali mas naging comfortable ako dahil nakakausap ko po siya ng maayos kung paano namin gagawin yung mga eksena same as with direct okay thank you very much Eliela for direct a question from Alan Policarpio of Inquirer for direct. What do you think are the reasons that push some people to catfish others? And do you think social media has become too ingrained in our lives? Uh, of course, social media is not just uh, engraved. It's also it's part of the lifestyle already. It's part of our life. Now, what? Uh, what uh, causes people to to catch catch catching or to uh, to be so near in this kind of concept? Maybe because the standards of beauty nowadays is very uh, elusive. I always uh, I always think that uh, the the standards of the society when it comes to beauty and acceptance is really really uh, superficial. That's why people uh, resort to this. Uh, Noon kasi, noon kasi kahit blind date, kahit pa sabihin mong blind date yan, set up ka ng date, ganyan, makikita mo ng personal. Uh, sa umpisa, hindi mo masyado magugustuhan, pero pag nakausap mo na while you're having dinner or anything, while you're have, uh, dating, yung yung first impression, mawawala yun kung maganda ka usap, kung may saysay ka kwentuhan. 
pero nowadays with the the fast ano fast technological advancement makita mo pa lang yung profile picture hindi mo na i-scan yung susunod eh, diba it's always the fa- the the best face forward sabi nga nila so sa panahon ngayon pagandahan ng profile picture pagandahan ng filtered photos kapag nagustuhan ka Okay na yun. Tapos pag nakita kayo ng personal, ibang-iba yung itsura niya sa, sa picture niya. You know, these things lead to catfishing eh. And sometimes doing catfishing is like living in an imaginative world where where, where, where you, you can enjoy affection and relationship at the same time. Which is very dangerous. Thank you so much, Direk, for that answer. And now we go to Ariela. You have a question from one of the press. Reaction niya sa openly gay si Beatrice Luigi Gomez, ang new Miss Universe, Philippines winner. At ano ang chance ni Beatrice sa Miss Universe? Makaka-affect kaya ang sequel, ang sequel orientation niya sa contest? First of all, wala nothing against her being an openly gay, actually. And I would say naman, It's maybe it's not the reason why she yung nanalo talaga was her performance performance during that night. I would say na talagang with the ramp and the way she presented herself, kanya talaga yung gabing yon. And then um, sumagot din siya ng maayos sa Q&A. So talagang kung baga from all those rounds, talagang check siya. Siguro nasa top talaga siya talaga ng mga judges. And it just so happened that openly gay siya. And ako naman, like, ever since, like, Miss Universe, talaga, it's it's very open na, I mean, they they have been really celebrating um, um, any gender right now. Sabi ko nga, every time tatanungin ako, um, siguro sa atin, panahon lang yung hinihintay, but we will get there. And now na nga, is the time dahil Bea would be the one representing our country and hindi naman and we all know that she's really loud and proud with her um sexuality and i don't see naman na magiging factor yon kung hindi kung about her performance internationally especially sa Miss Universe dahil nga as i said Miss Universe naman very ano yan open yan and very understanding as an organization and with her performance lahat nung if she would do kagaya ng ginawa niya nung finals night For sure, mapapansin talaga yan sa Miss Universe stage. And I like the way um, how she would answer question. Very chill niya. Makikita mo yung humility and yung personality niya, the way she answers. And ayun, basta ituloy-tuloy niya lang yan until the finals. I know two months na lang yung preparation. And kayang-kaya niya yan because of the team behind her naman. It's very prepared na. And for sure, they know what they would do for her. And there's another question for you also. Saka kung may kakilala ka na beauty queen na lesbian but closeted. Ha, ah, may kakilala ba ako na beauty queen na? <laughs> Napaisip. <laughs> Parang ah, wala. Uh, not naman, hindi, hindi, not, not the closet type. Parang alam naman ng mga tao din. Ah, okay. Something like that. Hmm. For the direct da, And the cast. Since pinag-uusapan from Ron Romulo of People's Balita, okay. Since pinag-uusapan ng Patik and Teaser, your opinion about the thrill and excitement making love inside the car. Any, if you have a chance, will you do it? Ulitin ko po yung questions. Since pinag-uusapan ang Patik and Teaser, in your opinion about the thrill and excitement making love inside the car. And if you have a, the chance... Will you do it? So, ang question lang po, yes or uh, yes or no po ang sagot dito. Um, simula natin kay um, Lassie, yes or no? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay. Kasi, ayun oh, lang. Uh, gusto mo explanation? Sige, <laughs> <laughs> gusto mo. Hindi, kasi niluwala ako na parang mala siya tagawin sa kotse. Parang ganun. Ah, may ganun. Hindi lang. Okay, mm-hmm. Kit? Set up. No. 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 Okay. Oh, do I need an explanation? <laughs> okay, kung gusto mo lang. Okay. Uh, well, yeah. Well, not naman malas, but... Mahaba ka kasi, car. mahirapan ka. Ano? Oh, <laughs> maha- <laughs> Mahirap po mano, kumigos. <laughs> ano yeah. ko na yun kay Candy yeah. Pangilina? <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm, I'm six feet tall, so it's hard. <laughs> Anong it's hard? Oh, uh, everything. <laughs> okay. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> ah, no. Nagawa okay. ko na po sa film. Joke lang. <laughs> <laughs> no po. Okay. Direct na. Sagutin ko talaga yan. <laughs> eh, kasi nakalagay for direct na. In the cast. Sinusunod ko lang po, no? <laughs> kung, biga, kung, bigay, kung bigay nung kasama ko yung kotse, why not? Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Ay, point si Derek. Mag-iba na ba yung sa Lassie? O, oh, oh, kung bibigyan ka ng kotse, kapalit yun. Oh. Oo naman, siya. Oh, di ba? O, di ba? Di ba? Derek, now you have a follow-up question. Yeah. There's a follow-up question for you. After two, Marco and Kit, na hunk, who's the next hunk you want to work with? And it seems fave mo, fave mo rin si Marion Honor. Are you preparing her for a bigger break? Akala ko hang si Marion ang Lord Si Marion. Yun din kasi nakadugtong eh. So Marco, I've worked with two Marcos already. Actually, three Marcos from Viva. Marco Gomez who was launched with Silab of Direct Joel Lamangan. I've worked with Marco Gumabaw in Revergenize with Sharon Cuneta. And Marco Gallio with Gluta and Ang Manananggal na Nahati Ang Puso. And then Kit. So, hindi ko alam kung sino Marco yung dalawa. Basta yun yung mga naka-work ko. Sino yung susunod? Na hunk. Na, na gusto hunk. mo. Na gusto mo. Wala, hindi, hindi ko alam. Pero etong yung susunod ko kasi sa SMP is Barong Bading. Eh. Ang kasama ko dun mga hunk talaga pero naging bading. Si Jerry Craval, si Baron Geisler, at saka si Mark Anthony Fernandez with Joel Torre. Yung... Susunod so, yung kakatapos ko lang i-shoot, ilo-launch ng, v- ng Viva yung apat na pantasya ng uh, pambansang pantasya, yung Heroic Beauties. Ang kasama nila doon, apat na hunk din. Yun yung mga naka-work ko, yung apat na yun. Pero yung after niyan, hindi ko pa alam kasi alam ko kasama kita sa susunod ko. Baka ikaw na yung susunod na hunk, Candy pa <laughs> Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Baka, I don't know. I'm not really particular when it comes to people, especially with the, with, especially with the, you know, the physicality. The bosses suggest eh, I just say go or maybe we can, we can fix another one for the title. No, I don't have any targets when it comes to actors and actresses. Even kahit pa sa hunk, ganyan. Eh, nahanapan ako ng ganon. Hindi, hindi ko naman alam eh kung sino. Depende siguro sa role. Yan. Okay, thank you, Direk. Meron ko daw plano for ano, Marion? Marion kasi is like, uh, Marion kasi is a good friend. Marion, ganito ang kwento. Alam to ni Kit, alam to ni Lassie, tsaka ni Ariela. Magchat lang ako, magte-text lang ako. Marion, kailangan ko ng music na ganito. Agad-agad, agad-agad. Mabilis pa sa alas 4 yan. May sisend na ng music. I can't think pa rin. If I have a material for her, siguro launch ng solo movie, ganyan. Maybe if I do my first musical, I don't know just yet. But my 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 relationship with Marion is ano, prof, it's it's a it's really going well. No, as a as, as a director and her as a music producer, she's really a genius. No, I all I I, I have always been saying this. Sa lahat ng kasabay niya, sa lahat ng contemporary niya. Napakahusay ni Marion Honor. For me, ha, alam niyo naman laging pinagko-compare yan si Marion at si Moira. No? And uh, I still can't compare pero ako, I've, always, I've been asked numerous times, I always say that Marion really is a genius. Okay, thank you, Derek. And now, yun na po, um, pagtatapos ng ating uh, digital press con. So may we ask the cast and the director to invite everyone to support the movie Sarap Mong Pati na ipapalabas po this October 15 only on TV <coughs> Max. Unahin na po natin kay Kit Sarap Thompson. Kit, please invite everyone to watch and support your movie. Nawala yata si Kit. Nawala nga si Kit. Napas, napasarap siguro. <laughs> Baka kung okay, pumunta na kotse. Okay, let's proceed to... Uh, <laughs> ay, 
bawal ayon na sa culture. So, Ariela? <laughs> Ay, naka-mute. Okay. Um, Una-una po, I want to say thank you sa ating mga friends from media and press for gracing our digital conference. And I'm inviting everyone po, three days na lang, malapit na malapit na po, sarap mong patayin, hmm. exclusively streaming on Viva Mac. Syempre, kasama ko po dito, Bob G. Bailey, Tart Carlos, Marion Honor, Kit Thompson, and Lassie Marquez, directed by Direct Daryl Yap. Kaya sana po, subaybayan so niyo po to. I mean, uh, abangan niyo po, tatlong tulog na lang. At ako po, excited po kung mapanood po ninyo this newest sexy psycho comedy film na handog po sa atin ng Viva. Kaya po, kita-kita po tayo October 15. Yes, Lassie? Yes, Una sa lahat, maraming maraming salamat sa mga nandirito ngayon sa ating uh, conference na ito. At syempre, maraming salamat po sa lahat mga sumusuporta sa pelikulang ito. At again and again, hindi ako magsasawa nga sabihin sa inyo na napakaganda ng pelikulang ito. Of course, ini-invite ko kayong lahat this coming October 15 na po ang sarap pong patayin sa Viva Max. At syempre, directed by Direct Daryl Yap. And dyan din po sila, Miss Marilyn Honor, Job, eh, Bob G. Bailey, Tart Carlos, Miss uh, Krista na ang ating si voice. Job, ano naman na oh, easy. Bob. Ayaw ko sabihin direct. O kaya ang kinorek ko. <laughs> Ayun. Siyempre si Ara Arida. And of course, si Keith Thompson. Ayan. At ako po, Lassie Marquez. This coming October 15 na po. At sa mga wala pang Viva Max, mag-download na po kayo. ha. At sabi sabihin natin panorin, sarap mong patayin. Yes, direct da. Yes, uh, darating pong October 15. Inyo pong abangan pagpatak ng uh, alas 12 ng ating gabi. Ang uh, sarap mong patayin ang pelikula po na pinagbibidakan nila Keith Thompson, Ariela Arida, Lassie Marquez, kasama rin po dito si Marian Honor, Bob G. Bailey, Tart Carlos. Ito po, ito po ay ang uh, kaunang ng sexy side comedy ng uh, Viva Max. Inyo pong panoorin exclusively sa ating uh, uh, sa ati asa ah, pinakamalakas na streaming platform sa ating bansa at sa karatig na mga bansa dahil uh, in just nine, nine months, months meron na po tayong one million subscribers so congratulations to everybody syempre dadagdag din ang mga mga kapanood ng sarap mong patayin dito maraming maraming salamat po sa support at pagtangkilik lalo na sa ating mga kaibigan sa press at media thank you po very much October 15 sarap mong patayin Maraming 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 salamat po sa lahat po nating media and blogger participants na sumali po at sumama po sa atin ngayong hapon. For updates on Sarap Mong Patayin, like and follow 